you're known now, renowned for your long range fishing. Um, I know you're uh, quite into your fishing lines uh, for that distance. Uh, we've got a line here called Zero. Can you talk me through it and uh, let me know what you know about Can it? Can do, yeah. It's uh, full of, we start off with the, uh, the diameters. It's a 12 pound um, breaking strain. It's got a 0 0.30 diameter here, which is, which is a good, yeah, it's, right. good it's thin for its, its poundage. And it's breaking above that as in the linear strength and not strength is going to be you know, in between the 12 and the 18 sort of thing. Yeah. Um, very limp, it's a very limp line, which is, uh, if I can get it here. So because it's limp, obviously, when it comes off the spool, it's not going to be, if you get stiff and wiry lines, they're like, tick, 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 they're always trying to catch. Okay. These will f absolutely fly off the spool. I mean, that's, as you can see, it's, it's just limp as, which is what you want. So, but the thing is, is about it, for me, it's the colour as well. I do right, like, okay, yeah. I, that's one of my favourite sort of colours. Yeah. Sort of, I call it a gun smoke. I don't know what they would put it as, but it's just it's just the sheer strength of it as well, which is okay. on a casting line you don't normally get. Casting line you're normally going to get a weakness in the, the braking strain and the abrasion resistant. This is giving you a lot of options in yep. there, you know, to, to actually deal with. Because okay. obviously, when you're at long range, I call long range 160 plus in some venues, you don't know what debris you're going to cross. That will stick up. It'll, it'll stick. Yeah. It, it'll be there. It'll still be in one piece strong. Yeah. Um, the other thing is we were just talking. What we ought to talk about is the relatively low stretch factor. And if you're fishing at long range, what you don't want is a line that's going to be very, very bungy. Okay. Because bite detection is going to be the fish could do 30 yards before you've even known about it. Because it's got a relatively low, it's still giving you a little bit there. And you're not going to get the same as braid, but it's giving you that little bit more yep. detection of a bite, which is what you want. And so when you've tried it, mate, you're going to love it. Yep, excellent.